Hey everyone, it's Crypto Profit back with another video, and today we're going to be talking a little bit about Clean Carbon, what this great project is, and how to get invested yourself. So the first thing I want to jump into and say is this project does have two independent audits that are being done right now, and the team is fully docked, so those transparency features are already in the mix. We continue to see a lot of reasons why this project is being trusted by so many. The project connects DeFi with physical waste to energy installations. So I want to jump into kind of the important pre-sale info and then dive into what clean carbon is. So the whitelisting, 3rd of April, 2022, 1300 UTC. The global pre-sale, 10th of April, 2022, 1300 UTC. The launch on PancakeSwap being the 8th of May, 2022, 1300 UTC. And the pre-sale participants will receive their carbon tokens on the 8th of May, 1300 UTC. So there's a lot of great dates coming up for Clean Carbon. If you guys want to learn a little bit more about Clean Carbon before we get to that pre-sale, before we get to those dates, make sure to jump down into the description of today's video. Click into the website, click into the Telegram, the Discord, learn a little bit more about this project and why you should or shouldn't get involved. Let's jump, though, a little bit through this project this website and learn a little bit more about what makes them so special. So DeFi response to the world pollution. And I want to jump down just a little bit to the project itself. The project part talks about how Clean Carbon is the first asset-backed, community-driven blockchain project that really cleans our planet. So they do have a nice little YouTube video going on. I'm going to pause it just so the the boy, or I guess the noise doesn't come through. But there is a reasons that clean carbon is doing so well. So the key facts is unique physical token utilities, the pilot project, and they also have the full support of the local government, all necessary partnerships established, fully finalized legal framework, a lot of great things basically coming into play here. Um, and, you know, as we go through, I want to give you guys some bullet points that I've actually come up with while looking through this project. Uh, we also have Clean Carbon Project itself created to help clean our planet effectively, combines DeFi with waste to energy installations, unique business model, token supports installations, also installation support token, pilot project that we uh, just actually mentioned up here. We had this uh, you know, pilot project is one of the key facts and state of the art project tokenomics, a global community of investors experienced and accomplished. Uh, it, really, the team itself is actually very experienced. We'll jump into the team tab here in a second, but they also have experienced and accomplished team, carefully planned global expansion and the vision for the next 10 years and beyond. So this isn't a short term project. This is a project that's going to stick around for many, many years to come. Uh, I want to talk a little bit about the carbon utility uh well really token utilities of anything so let's jump down to the token itself they have asset backs carbon platform or the carbo platform is the initiative platform or an innovative platform containing multiple carbo token utilities collected in one place for users convenience so we're seeing a lot of reasons as to why people are getting involved the marketing the physical utilities, the community-driven stuff that they are bringing to this platform, the auto-reflections, and then they also have some tax things as well. So here you can see the 5% buying fee and 5% selling fee. When they do these for cryptocurrencies, they usually work out very, very well because they are going to make the coin typically, well, in this case, 5% selling fee. It's giving you a 4% RFI staking for Carbo. So staking is going to be very, very rewarding. And then we also have pancake swap liquidity, keeping that coin right on that pancake swap listing successful ever since the listing. So 5% buying fee being 3% daily staking, BUSD, pancake swap liquidity, Carbo, treasury, and 0.5% on buybacks as well. So all over the place, but definitely a lot of good things that they're doing here. I do want to scroll a little bit farther down into the site because next we have these systems and you guys should understand what are the benefits. So 100% carbon neutral, closed one-step process, on-site decentralized operation, almost full conversion into pure Singas. And we also have the high quality gas over other technologies as well as fully automated and low energy consumption. What can be utilized? So there's a lot of things that they're actually utilizing with clean carbon all types of organic waste, household waste products, all kinds of plastic materials, toxic and hazardous substances. They also have the tires and other petroleum products and industrial and agriculture by products as well. So a lot of utility coming to play here. The big thing that's really bringing this project to the forefront for me is the team. So these are teams uh, are really a team of people that have done a lot of things successfully in the past. You have some of the biggest names out there in the space. If you guys haven't learned about these people before, definitely jump into their LinkedIn profiles. They'll talk a little bit about what they've done, what they're planning to do, kind of their about 
and you can see that all right here and every single team member does have that kind of about page and giving you an example of what they are trying to accomplish with what they've done in the past so a very very solid team like i said as well as a roadmap and you guys know on this channel we love roadmaps we talk about roadmaps all the time because it does show you guys a lot of what is coming as well as what they have done in the past successfully because they always show you know q4 2021 have they done these things have they completed these things so you can see the check marks here obviously they have now we're on to q1 2022 and you can actually see that they are continuing to work on a lot of these things so um you know currently being played and we also have q2 2022 and then q3 2022 and q4 2022 so a lot of cool things but i want to jump into q2 so we have q2 being a very very big quarter for 2022 being Carbo global presale, the token listing launch of clean carbon platform launch on pancake swap, the first burning events, creation of the Carbo treasury, start of the buyback program, launch on the first CEX, land purchase of the installation. They also have pilot project construction license and a lot of other stuff coming. So we will definitely do more update videos on this uh, project in the near future and talk about these specific things as they get really finalized and as they get completed. I want to jump though over to Q3 just kind of quickly go through some of these things in Q3 and Q4 that you can guys can really look out for. Extra funding from EU, uh, or EU subventions, community voting platforms, massive global marketing, pilot project installation testing, buybacks and burning events, legal framework for the first expansion, listing Carbo on the next CEX, clean carbon mobile app completed, a lot of cool things coming. And Q4, even more. So the pilot project fully operating, purchase of the next UHTG unit, they also have the buybacks and burning events. The new roadmap for 2023 is going to be coming. So we're never going to be without a roadmap, it seems, which is always something I love to hear. I love to know where we're going next with the project. What's the next utility we're building? What's the next use case we're going to continue to improve on? And that's what you're going to get with Clean Carbon. If we jump down to the FAQ, we can see that they do have some frequently asked questions. So if you guys are interested to learn a little bit more, these are going to be the questions that a lot of you guys probably have and, well, can be answered here. So definitely take a look yourself. I do want to jump over to their Twitter because if you haven't already, jump down into the description of today's video. Make sure to follow them on Twitter. I'm already following them. I've been following them for a while. This is a project, like I said, that I do have a lot of, uh, you know, a lot of hope for. I think this is a project that has huge potential. And because of that, we're going to continue, like I said, to keep you guys up to date on what's going on in the near future with this project as we move forward. So thank you guys again for tuning in. If you have not already, make sure to like the video, subscribe to the channel, and turn notifications on. I'll see you guys all in the next one.